Yeah. He said they, he let them know, like they didn't know anything about it. So. Yeah, Sarah said we'd have it over here. Um, Steve, who'd you say the other, him? They didn't know nothing. They they don't know they dietary. Didn't tell them, so. Huh? The guy said he would tell them. All right, because like I said, we kind of need it over because it starts at 2. Yeah. Dietary. Yeah. Well, like I said, uh, I'm, I'm sure there's a note somewhere because Sarah made sure about it because right. she was kind of worried about Bob. Okay. I know, I keep, I keep I saying that, but I don't know how else to tell anybody. Can you go on my Facebook and see if that's live? I know you're afraid of me there. Make sure that's pointed at the cake table. <laughs> Hey, Steve, I 
that uniform is a
I didn't yeah. see that. I know she's like in first grade. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. 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 She goes, Mom, take a picture. She goes, my friends won't believe me. She better frame that thing.
five minutes there was the oh, right the immune scalp. Oh. <laughs> and I don't remember rat. So So when you say now after this baby goes on, oh, how are you gonna divide it? I'm gonna go get on my scalp. How are you gonna divide with that? Because he usually says I'm gonna go get on my video bike.
Corps celebrates 244 years of war fighting excellence and uncommon valor. The United States Marines define the world image of elite warrior citizens. We take pride in the legacy built by those who came before us and in carrying that legacy into the future. Capabilities, battlefields, and adversaries change, and, the, and Marines continue to adapt to every challenge. Prepare to fight and win wherever and whenever our nation calls. What does not change is the Marine spirit, a warrior spirit rooted in our core values. The strengths of our Marine, of our core, is our Marines. Our success depends <laughs> on all Marines embodied embodying the values of our core, which was founded, it required. Leveraging the talents and ingenuity of every Marine to strengthen our core. Since 1775, courageous Marines have answered the call to fight for freedom and to shape our reputation as the most fierce fighting force in the, war the world has seen. Marines, each generation approached every battle with a lethal combination of versatility, perseverance, and adaptability that has allowed us to prevail in any climb and place. Therefore, the 244-year history of the Marine Corps, our nation has required Marines to adapt capabilities and fighting styles to defeat adversaries in all domains. The Marines who took to the seas with naval counterparts to combat the Barbary pilots solidified our role as a naval expeditionary force in readiness. World War I saw the Marines fighting sustained land campaigns and returned, returning from those battles to immediately being redesigned how to fight, how to go to fight war. Those innovations laid the foundation for the amphibious landings of World War II combat operations in Korea and Vietnam brought harsh climates and unforgiving terrains that again forced Marines to adapt and overcome. In Iraq and Afghanistan, urban battlefields and counterinsurgency tactics demanded innovations in warfare or in war fighting strategies and capabilities. Today, we find ourselves once again facing new and evolving threats in different operational environments. Like our predecessors, we will move forward with the lessons learned from past conflicts while redesigning the force and innovating for future conflict with any adversary who dares to fight. Marines, congratulations on 244 years of excellence. Like the first birthday message published by the 13th Commandant General John Lejeune in 1921, this message serves as a reminder of the legacy we are charged with upholding. Today is our birthday. Today is our day to celebrate our heritage and to honor sacrifices of those who have fought before us. It is also to, a day to recommit ourselves to our core values and resolute, resolutely pursue the strength of character that defines the United States Marines. And it is a day to look forward to war forward future battlefields, to prepare to uphold and to distinguish warfighting legacy our predecessors wherever, whenever our nation calls. Happy birthday, Marines. David H. Berger, General United States Marine Corps, Commandant United States Marine Corps. And now we will sing the first verse of the Marine Corps hymn. Ready? The halls of Montezuma to the shores of Tripoli. We fight our country's battles on the land of air and sea. First to fight for right and freedom and to keep our honor clean. We are proud to claim the title of United States Marine. Youngest and the oldest Marines come forward so we can cut the cake. John? Okay. What do we want to do?
They're still doing good. No, 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 you're fine. I I go around everybody. That's a that was, yes. Yes. I mean, they, they wouldn't even take you down to the edge for the rainbow. 
Thanks, everybody, for joining us today. The next live broadcast will be from the Elks Club Marine Corps Banquet. Don't forget, bring your family out there. It's open to all branches tonight, 1700.